Hello everybody and welcome back to the vlog. So, as you guys can see, we are pretty good on hay. I'm pretty good on um, rolling. We rolled these fields. Um, I finished up this field late last night. Um, now what we gotta do is we gotta go and talk to the store about a potential um, having a I will show you let's see if we have it first right here no so we need to have a mower um, we are looking for a mower that can do rows I guess I think this one can do rows I'm not so sure about it let's just check Yes, this can actually can do rows, but what we are going to buy is a passenger. And we're going to buy a, I guess, a wind rower. This is something that we didn't buy. I talked to the store about it. They gave me access to the store page where I can buy online and they can just put it outside ready for us to come and pick it up so this is what we are going to do today not a tether we need to have a wind rower so I thought about taking this one but we need to have a bit bigger one which it is a bit smaller which leaves us only with this one and we don't have enough money all right so so you can guess what we are doing today, hopefully. We are planning to get cows today. So we need to get ready for for them. I talked to a dealership that um, they can come in the livestock market, sorry. That they are going to come and bring the cows for us um, tomorrow, first thing in the morning. So we need to prepare um, silage. This is why I am actually cutting down the grass. It's going to be very nice to see all of the cows run around here. And we need to move the hay bales and the grass bales, but I'm not going to do this until we will have a big load to transfer over there. So this is where we can have two loads two in two places. Because I'm not going to leave the feeding mixer with the tractor down there just because it's not... Whoa! Ooh. All right. I need to get used to that running around. I wish to own this field, actually. It looks pretty good. So, I know we bought the mowers, but I guess we are not going to keep them. This is my thinking. I'm not so sure yet. I'm not so sure if I'm going to keep the well, uh, wind rollers, the mowers. Sorry. Um, I just bought it for now, so we can have it. And um, we need to see how much grass we need to do. All right. As you guys can see, we bought it, and they said it's waiting out back. They told me to take care. To see what is available and. All right, let's pack it up. Oh, right. they're ready to go home. So, as you guys can see, looks um, pretty new. Everything is new, of course. Um, they are going to give us a demo for the loading wagon, which uh, it's pretty exciting. They're going to leave us with a bigger one so we can do the vast job because I told them I need to pick it up fast we don't have a bunch of time so they said yeah but you're the new guy we don't know you so we cannot give you all the time um, uh, give you stuff to try so I told them yeah but I really need that and I will not break it so I have a huge responsibility for our machinery that I'm going to get soon enough 
And the next tractor is going that I'm considering selling is this guy. It's a beautiful tractor, but it's old. Um, it did it work pretty good. Um, I don't know yet. All right. Zach is right here. This is his house. I think we have an entrance to the. Ouch. Not the curb. I think we have an interest in this field from up here. If not, I'm... Nope. Oh, no. Alright, so we will have to do a UE. That we had. Um, this is the field that I'm talking about. This is going to be a grass field, silage field. Um, I know I cut down this field, but... Nobody's coming. Okay. And sheep is also something that I really wanted to do. Alright, so. Oh, I love this sun on the John Deere. Look at that. This is amazing. Alright, so. Whoa, let's see if I want to get in with the gates. Ow! Oh, I'm not so careful these days. Alright, as you guys can see, this is our newest addition to the farm. stuff from here and yep pretty nice for us all right so this field is going to be our grass field Um, but I'm not going to use all of this for grass because we have a lot. This is a massive field. So we will have to, I don't know how, somehow we will have to fit in a loading wagon in here. Which I'm a bit scared, I don't know how to do it. I never even touched before my, um, and I load in the wagon. Oh, okay. All right, so I will ask as well for Zach to come and help us out in here, just because I'm clueless, really. Well, this is a satisfying job. As I told you, I'm not going to cut down all of this, just because we don't need it. Maybe we will have to eventually for the cattle, give them grass and hay. Yeah. All right, we can in here. All right, so we will, st we will start our time lapse. And I will see you guys when we finished.
was done. And the Rangers came, and it's a bad idea for mowing grass in the rain because it can get stuck. So what we are going to do, we are going to finish as long as we can. We will finish up the field and we will wind roll it tomorrow. So we have a lot going on tomorrow. We will have to go and sleep. Uh, what I am going to do is I'm actually going to go to the store and bring back the wind roller so it will be ready with the tractor waiting for us in the field. And as well, I'm going to pick up, I will call the dealership, I will ask them if they have a good deal for a good um, loading order, which I'm sure they have, just because I'm a new in town, so they, are, they don't trust me with new stuff, which is a shame. Alright, so we are done. See if we can do it in one row. Ow! Now I understand why this store does want me to have a nice. No, oh, come on! Alright, so I need to get used to this controls as you guys see I am a bit rusty. We are sleeping on this. This gate is open. We will leave this gate open just we had problem with this gate. As and as of right now we don't have animals inside so we are good to go with leaving this gate open. When the neighbor said, this is not a field that the horses are in it, this is just for training purposes. So usually when, it's when he will use it, so he will close, and we will close both of those gates. And we need to talk about chickens. We need to talk to the dealership as well and I think we will head to bed I will head to sleep it's already 7.30 in the middle of the afternoon so I think we will rest as you guys can see it's getting really wet right there with the rain and the grass so if we're doing that we're going to park it up right here Something I never knew when I was a kid that my grandparents actually did this. I didn't know about this existed. I never even try and look inside because of his the, the gate is so rusty, but it's okay. Come on. Alright. Make a bit of a U-turn right here. Get the front of the wall. We will park it up right here. We will head to the store, obviously. And our farm is actually getting pretty busy with um, machinery, which I like. My grandparents didn't have a lot of equipment. Most of theirs were old, so we sold at an auction, but yeah. So this is the field that actually needs to get, um, I think, tr no, not drilled. It needs to get, I can't, come on, move. So this field actually needs to get um, rolled with the roller. This field is, so this field doesn't. 
so we need to do this as well and I really want to make an entrance right here but the county doesn't let me like this one like you're having the road with a gate so this tractor is pretty good you can look at the controls everything out is uh, banged in a tree this tractor is really good control wise it's um, next to your hands but it's also really confusing for me all right here's the store pick up the ring drawer Whoops, careful not to bang in these doors. I will make a call, I will come home, we will park it up in the field. And I will get in the house, I will get in the gator. And I will... Oh, well, it's really getting nasty. Alright, so we are almost at the farm, which I hate the rain. I really hate the rain. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull it in here. The skate needs to be a bit wider, especially when we are coming in with a big machine. So we will park it up right there with the John Deere. We will hop the fence. I don't want to do. It. I don't want to wind roll it as now, just because it will be wet. And I think it can go um, mucky. We'll leave it right here. Oh, I'm a little cold. I forgot my coat. And I'm going short sleeves. Alright, so pretty it looks pretty good. I'm really impressed. Whoops. So we will get in the gator, we will hop in the gator, we will go home. We will rest. pretty good. I'm really happy with this purchase. Alright. Hello ma'am. So, let's park up right here. I can park it right there, up there, but I don't fancy. Alright guys. I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. So, next day, no rain. It's around 8 in the morning. So, we can go ahead and go to the field. Which I don't need the tractor. F the just for that. But you know what we are going to do? is We are going to go into the dealership today. So, we need to go ahead with the Massey Ferguson and buy the bigger the bigger wheel loader uh, not wheel loader sorry guys the bigger let's see what's the biggest oh. of course I can do bales we have a big pretty big oh wow cold start 
We, pre we have pretty good bailer for this operation, but... Oh, wow, look at that. The natural... Look at that. Oh, that. We are getting carried on. Alright, so it's an hourly fee, which I really want... I don't want to overpass it. It's 6,000 per hour. Which I don't fancy paying two hours. Look at this beautiful tractor. Control as well. I really like those. This is really simple, but the buttons here are not fancy. Alright, so we will go to the store. Let's go up. On this tractor. You can feel the weight actually when you're pulling it up in hill. This is a really nice field to own if you want to have a big grass field but uh, i'm fine with what we have and we are not going to start with so many cows either we still need to we have the actually we need to wait for the best prices for the barley i don't want to wait until the harvest season for this ones because the bills are not going to hold it up even though we have a lot but again we lost a bit, so nothing is perfect. Okay, now let's turn it here like that. Don't clip the neighbor's house, please. And not our gate as well. Okay, here it goes. All right, so we did it. Now what we is left, all is left to do is windrow it and pick it up. So. Let's see if Zach will actually be able to come and help us with this. Because I need all the help I can get. It's a big one. I think it's going to take all, all of our field in one swip. So let's hope for that. Now I have to do a really this. We have the big chunky tires. So I think, I think we will leave it. Um, not running. So, the drone is in the air. Let's go.
goodbye guys we are full first ever load on this beast and look what I found no no cows oh. Oh. all right um, so I did switch um, Zach actually came and helped us um, which I switched with him between he said he will do this and I will do that just because it's a bit complicated and it's we have chunky tires so it lifts up the I hope I hope the star is not going to find me for that I'm doing all sorts of UE torrents. Well, this is actually really cut nice. It's like low and shallow, not big. Alright, you, you can see where I missed bits with the mower, but it's okay. So the big question is, this is too big for our operation, but I have to have something really fairly quickly. Let's open up the slides. We can actually cross here, so we don't need to have the indicators. Um, yeah, so it's 9 o'clock, it's 9.30 actually. It's pretty early still, foggy as well. Oh no, as you guys can see it's a bit... I saw a rabbit? I think I saw a rabbit jumping. I, s I think I saw a rabbit jumping over there. Alright. Now you will see um, what is my concern here, which we are really close to. And this is the pit. Um, I don't know how we are going to succeed in reversing it in. I think I think the neighbors don't mind me. Okay. Right. What we are going to do is not get inside here. Okay. Right. This is really complicated oh, I hope the neighbor is okay with that I stepped in his field of course I will tell him that I have to back in a silage a forage wagon a big forage wagon on this field Back up. It's, I didn't. All right, so we will put the two rows one in front of another. So still a lot left, but I wanted to be organized a bit so it will be easier to compact it. Which I think this is something that I learned with our old forage wagon that we had. We had something that we built on our own. Something like that, my grandpa my grandparents built it. As well as this cow barn, they built it on their own, so pretty lucky to actually own it to myself. Alright, so first load is in. Let's go pick up another one. Uh. <laughs>
Alright, so... Now what we can do is... Um, I'm still getting used to all of those controls, which... Be, I, let me be honest with you guys, it's pretty annoying. So what I'm going to do is going to take these pieces right here that missed up. Okay. We still have two rows right there and then we have the big chunk right here. Which I am going to do it eventually. As of right now, we are almost full. If you had a gate behind, you can know how much you are full with. We can see how much we are getting up. Barely. It's not the perfect way to do it, but it is what it is. We need to pick it up. And Zach, if you're watching, please. His real name is actually Ziki, I think. But ugh. let's let's not tell him that. I told you guys. All right, so we are almost finished with this load, which is going to take us out a, a tra two trailers and actually trailers in a half. Two trailers in a half. My guess is. All right. This <laughs> All right, we need to go and unload it again. Yay. So, I thought I have the biggest one in the game that you can act you don't have, but it's pretty good. It's actually for this field, three and a half times, three times loading it. It's pretty good, especially when we're making it as fast as we do it. Looks really good. Which I'm really pleased about. But we have to do the job properly and fast as well. So, I will load up this trailer. Yeah. Get the birds. Get away, birds. Alright, so, I will load up this piece that left we're pretty fast with this but we need to really slow down right now because last time we almost broke the fence yeah there is my point all right i need to jump into the john deere which he left us. Thank you, Zach. And we need to actually go ahead and go there. So this is actually our property line. Um, we can do whatever we want to as far as expansion of the land, which I, I'm not saying anything. I'm not going to build anything. I'm living it as it is because I don't want to ruin everything that my grandparents built. But, I'm just saying we have an option to do something else in here. Maybe more cattle. I'm, I'm not sure I'm going to do any more cattle with what we have already. Because what we have is pretty much a lot. I think it's 400 cows can fit in there. I'm so down about it. But my grandparents told me that this is an option, if I want to do it, I can expand the cow barn. Which maybe we will do if we will see it's worth it, but the cattle actually... The sheep are actually most profit to be here in this area, I guess. So you can fit in in this area alone. 400 sheep, 450 sheep I think. Pretty good. Alright, so... Let's not stop you right here. Hey, Ralph. A John Deere and Case working together in the same field. <laughs> Alright, so 
Let's let us leave us running. It's not a big of a job. And just as I saw, but I'm going not flip the gate. I am going to flip the gate. Pretty good. Let's not hit the water ball. And we are in like a block. Alright, so let's pick up these pieces. This is going to be not... It's not going even to fill up a half trailer. I would be surprised if, 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 it's, if it is. It's because you see. It's not fertilized, so we need to actually be on top of fertilization. 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 Okay. Um, so I need to talk to, some, to the dealership as, again, and I have me um, finding... a fertilizer spreader. I need to have a big working with just because of the massive fields that we got. Looks good, looks good guys. So I am impressive. Thank you for the dealership for actually giving us the opportunity to use this machine. I'm pretty happy about it. I'm not disappointed at all. I did the job done, but the floating, we have big tires, so it's a bit... The tractor doesn't like the passenger behind him. So, um, we have two rows left to go. It's going to fill up our trailer, not in the, entirely, but it is going to give us a bit extra. So, from this field, I don't know exactly how much feeding can we do from this field, but... I guess just time will tell. This is amazing. I love this tractor and I love the combo. I love this combo. I love this map as well. I love this area. the 8S series. I feel one lucky to own one of those. I think it's the pretty new one, I guess. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel really lucky. This is pretty new tractor for the farm. It's a new tractor, actually. But in me, I didn't know. But if, let me know in the down in the comments if it's the newest one that came out. The new series? And if so, I'm, I'm, I'm really feeling lucky to own it. As you guys can see, I was with uh, short sleeves um, in the rain, which I'm freezing, but it's okay. Love the animation that goes on in here. Oh, okay. Alright, guys, we are officially done with this passenger. So we can go ahead and go dump it in the silo. Why do we don't have a gate right here? Come on, we can put in a fence and a gateway here. Alright, never mind. We will do the big turn. Alright, so we will go ahead and dump this, dump this in the side. I know we have a lot of misfits, but it's fine. It, really, it's okay. I will do a, a better job last, um, soon next time that we will have to do it. I'm just... I need to have silage as soon as possible because the cows are coming soon, sooner rather. I thought they will come next weekend. Next week. But um, unfortunately they are coming this week so hopefully we will have a big silage. So this is the starting silage that we will have. 
Eventually, I want to have as well um, do a maze. Which one of the fields will be maze? Corn. Let's try it out without breaking any law. We did it. Okay, this is going to be. Is it not going to be? I think. No, 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 it's not. It's going to be better. As far as I'm not going to bro break anything in here. Alright, so from coming from this way, it's pretty much guaranteed that you can back in and just reverse it in. Just by taking the entire road. Alright guys, um, Zach didn't help, so he didn't pick up the phone, but I'm doing this up and now thingy for um, almost an hour and a half, which I guess it's trying to cover that up, which is going to be a bit hard, so this one I'm going, I will need his help. We have weights on this track that I didn't even know about, so All right, let's cover. Alright, so this is it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in our next vlog. Bye for now.